Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be my recent favorite beauty products. Um, I really didn't get into the monthly month um, favorites because, not that I don't have favorites per month because I have a lot of makeup and I do try to switch my makeup a lot around, but I just can't find the time every month to, to sacrifice, well, to commit every month to record a favorite video. So, I decided since I have the time today, let me record my recent favorite. Okay guys, my first item is the Garnier Nutrish um, Skin Renewal Anti-Puff Eye Roller. I am in love with this product. I purchased this like about a couple of weeks ago because lately I haven't been getting that much sleep so I wake up with like, you know, baggy eyes. So I decided to give this a try. Love, love, love this. I roll it on right underneath my eyes. At the same time, it gives your eye like a little bit um, of a massage when you roll it in. And that's very good to help the blood circulate into that area. So love, love, love this. They also sell it in um, like the tinted one that has like a little color to it, the light, medium, and dark. But the dark is for what I call to be a... Caucasian person with a tan because the dark is literally like as light as I don't know But what I was looking for Anyway moving on because I do have a lot of products um, Next thing that's part of my favorite is this um benefits poor professional is to minimize the appearance of pores I saw this on I can't remember who's um, channeled but once I find out, I'll put a link in the description bound down below. But I decided, okay, let me give it a try. Mm, I have large pores underneath my eyes, T-zone area on top of my nose, all in this section right here. So I decided, let me give this a try. Love, 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 love this. This with my Black Radiance Shine Control Primer and love. Now, I don't have oily skin to be using this primer, but I live in an area with, where it's a very warm climate where you can walk out your door and right away you'll have a little bit of, you know, sweat balls coming through, you know, a little sweat come through, and I don't like that, especially when I apply, you know, makeup. So I use like oil-free or oil control primers or anything to minimize my oils to come through because the same glands where your sweat comes through to <clears throat> to hold down like me from sweating a lot so between these three products this my milk of magnesia this and this my makeup lasts literally all day with not even one sweat ball coming through my makeup love 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 it so i've been in love with these three products you would not imagine. Next thing is my e.l.f. Mineral Blemish Powder. This one is in clear. It goes on translucent. I've been using this to basically set my under eye bright concealer that I use. And the one that I do use is the Maybelline Age Nouveau Age Rewind um, concealer. This is in the color Honey, number 40. Yes, it's a lot, lot lighter than my skin tone, but I'm wearing it right now. It's just to give me that, well, quote unquote, Kim Kardashian under eye brightness look. I love the look, so that's what I use. So these are part of my favorite also. Next thing is I've gotten back in touch with my mineralize, um, mineral eyeshadow from e.l.f. Love these. I own a lot of colors. Lewis, this, this. I had stopped using them because, like I said, you get a lot of new products, so you kind of put the, the oldest one aside. But now, recently, I've been, you know, rotating a lot, especially my eyeshadows. So I am loving, loving this. Right now, on my eyes, I am wearing Natural. Natural over here. That's natural, just as my eyeshadow base. Love it, love it, love it. Next thing is this little baby right here. I just got this a couple weeks ago. It's What's Up from Benefits. It's the same time I purchased 
this I got this as a present or as a gift you know when I ordered and I'm in love with this this is supposed to be a highlighter for face it comes like in a little lipstick tube pulls up like that if you guys can see that I love it love it I have it right now over here a little bit on the side also it gives it has like a nice champagne color right there and I am in love with it next thing that I'm in love with is my NYX matte bronzer in deep tan I love 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 this I use this as a um, foundation for the summertime you know it's a bronzer but since this is the deepest color that NYX decided to do I can't use it as a bronzer because it's exactly my skin tone so I use it as a foundation powder and guys I love it I love it I just put on my concealer put on my bright um, concealer for under eye and I top it off with this today I'm not wearing it today I am wearing another of my favorite is the black radiance mineral foundation powder they come in a dual package just like this it's called um, perfection perfect blend mineralized foundation from black radiance I got this at my local Walgreens one thing that I do like about it because they come in a pack of two you know because most of dark skinned women have more of a two tone color we're mostly lighter in the inner darker on the outer so I love the fact that they include this the color that I have is 8201 in light one is the lighter this one is the darker and they'll tell you which is which so love 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 these. next thing on my list is the Milani illuminating face powder I am in love with these I have all three this one is the Hermosa Rose love this I am wearing it also on my as a highlight on my cheekbones next thing that I have been using on a regular basis as my concealer is my Smashbox in dark I've had this concealer for um, a while now um, I'm trying to finish it up I really love it I like it uh, I am not gonna repurchase it it's almost done I'm not going to repurchase it just for the simple fact I have a lot of other concealers that I'm trying to finish up also. But this concealer I have been using for the past couple of weeks now. For blush, I've been using my cream blush. This is a hard candy um, cheek glow. It's a dual. One side it says in love. The other one, well, I guess that's the color for both. Number 315 is just this side. And that side next thing are my NYX cream blush love 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 this this one is in glow I also I I have also blah, 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 I can't talk I've also been using my mosaic blush from NYX and this one is in love what else what else what else what else what else what else made it to my list for this month I think that's basically it. Uh, oh no, no. Last but not least, my e.l.f. cream blush. And this is, I'm wearing that today. Just a flush of cl color on top of my cheekbone. This is another thing that reminds me of those um, dreamy, moussey um, from Maybelline blushes. This one is in Vixen. Yeah. I love it but it's the same type of texture like a sponge type of texture so I've had this for a while and I've been using my cream blush because now that's a little bit warmer I love the fact with the cream I can set it and it lasts a little bit longer especially if I don't use my um, milk of Mynasia my sweat comes through and it, it takes my blush out quicker so but when I put a cream blush and set it it tends to last a little bit longer so that's about it that's basically it for my current favorite I hope you guys enjoy and I will see you guys on my next video bye